Hello everybody, today I want to organize my desk, but not organize my desk on a normal level. Organize my desk on that soul satisfying level that engages with my OCD. I will go through different items that I made or found online that helped me get my shit together and that I think could help you guys organize your own desk. So if you are interested in 3D printing or just want to see some desk organization tips that might help you in your own life, stick around and find out to see how I go about it. This is my desk before doing anything. I think it looks a bit boring. So the first thing I want to do and the only non 3D printed thing I will be adding to my desk today is some plants. Ah, that's already much better. Do you ever find yourself knee deep in heavy work, too focused on your task to go to the next bin and toss that stray snack wrapper or scribble note to the trash? My solution is this desk bin with a roman pillar design and a brown color to match my tabletop making the experience of throwing away trash downright classy. Now I no longer need to walk to the kitchen bin because I have a quickly accessible spot right behind my monitor to toss my garbage. Sometimes you just need an extra drawer. Like really, just one or more little nook for your odd items. Back when I didn't have the IKEA Alex shelf, I just needed a simple drawer. So I built a rail system that lets me easily attach different gadgets to my desk. Drawers, organizers, you name it. Even though I eventually upgraded to the IKEA Alex cabinet, I couldn't bear part with my trusty little desk drawer. It's still around, ready to store random essentials, like this 3D printed bolt for my chair, just in case the one I'm sitting on decides to bail on me again. Do you sometimes struggle to find the right spot to charge all your USB-C accessories? Even if USB-C is universal, I often struggle to find the correct spot to charge my accessories. Every charger seems to support different voltages and doesn't always work flawlessly. For example, MacBook chargers don't support 12 volt charging. Especially for electronics projects, this can be really annoying. So I made a quickly accessible rail mounted USB-C charger that supports all voltages I need. And more importantly, it's always under my desk ready to reach when I need anything. I know these changes might seem small, but I can assure you I use every single one of these items every day. Especially the trash can helps me keep my mind off the trash and my anchor desk charger makes it super easy to charge anything. I never have to move from my desk to get to the trash or charge my equipment. I will leave links for the trash can, the anchor charger and a few other items in the description below. And now let's talk about the new additions to my desk. Lately I've been embracing a bit of organized chaos in my camera gear. I've been purposely avoiding packing it away after every shoot so I can grab it in a flash when inspiration strikes. I find this habit makes just everything more quickly accessible. The issue is if everything is just lying around, dust gathers and is at a risk of scratching. I decided to bring some order to all this madness by adding a gridfinity system to the top three cupboards of my Alex drawer. I first tested some trays and they were great and easy to design. So I made foam inlays for my lenses and camera to give them some nice soft space in my drawers. And now look how easy it is to access all my camera stuff. I've organized a massive number of items with their own trays. I use Gridfinity trays for everything. The soldering iron, wire stripper, solder flux, power bank, airpods, calipers, wrench, and even my Pocket 3 all have their dedicated space. Now whenever I need something I can quickly grab it from memory knowing exactly where it lies and then put it back to keep everything perfectly organized. My girlfriend got me this beautiful candle holder. It looks fantastic when the candle is burning. But when it is not in use, the wax tends to drip everywhere and an empty unlit candle just doesn't cut it aesthetically. So I 3D printed a stylish little basket with a hexagon mesh, designed to hide the wax and the unused candle when it's off. It blends perfectly with my wooden decor and the best part is that when the candle is lit, the basket casts a cool pattern on the wall, really enhancing the atmosphere. Thank you. 
Here's a quick overview of some extra 3D printed stuff I use at my desk. My girlfriend designed these parametric cable ties. And they are super useful to organize some cables. Here's my small parts tray I've been using. While I'm working on projects, I keep screws in the tray. And now I have this Gridfinity upgrade that fits perfectly into my desk drawers. As well as that, I also made some bread board holders. To make the bread boards blend in better with my desk while I'm working. As you guys can see, 3D printing and some little plants can have a major effect in the looks department and usability of my desk. Before I used to store my camera in pelican cases, which would have me thinking twice if I wanted to pull out my camera. This Gridfinity system has really had a big effect on my workflow. Alongside with my own Gridfinity trays, Gridfinity is definitely very cool because it has a large community surrounding it. Anytime you need a tray for any tool, you can just Google it and chances are high a tray already exists for anything you might need. Screwdrivers, tweezers, pencils, cameras, you name it. Really anything. And this is just a small set of ideas for your own desk organization journey. How do you guys feel about this upgrade? Am I missing something? Which items made the biggest change on your own desk? Thank you guys for listening and I wish you an excellent day. Cheers! Oh.